And so you're very happy, so you should be. Fabulous body shot that ended that fight in the end. But again, criticism, you just can't, can't seem to stay away from criticism. People are saying, not a proper body shot. What are you saying to that? Uh, no, I don't understand. You know, you know, if you watch it closely, you see his rib move. You know, the shot hit him with, uh, he went down in pain. He tried to make out that he was uh, behind, the back, uh, behind the back shot, started having a count. Luke, he was in pain. I heard him, I think it was a body shot. And the second round took all the wind out of him. And, you know, I could have finished him off him, but, you know, I just wanted to take my time and do things properly. Talk about doing things properly. If you were to look at that fight right from the beginning, that's a perfect advertisement for young boxers about how a jab can not only set up all your other punches, but also win a fight for you. I mean, your jab was phenomenal at this fight. Yeah, I've always had a good jab. You know, I'm just starting to use it a lot more now. Um, you know, I went to, I went to the pop out right hand in quite a lot, but he, he was moving quite well. He was, he was good in his feet, and you know, I seemed to be able to distance with the right hand. So you know, I was just comfy breaking him down bit by bit with the jab. And, you know, some of them jabs I hit him and knocked people out. And you know, he's a tough, he's a tough boy, but. Uh, at the end of the day, I think I was a step above. You know, he's ranked in WBO, WBC, and IBF championships. Uh, and you know, I just ripped through him quite comfortably. Did you find yourself having to be patient during this fight? Because as you say, you wanted to go in there early in the second round. Did you find yourself having to be patient? Like I said, yeah, I did hurt him in the second round, but he, he was clever. He was trying to make me fall out the distance. Uh, I don't know the Enzo of two years ago could have waded in and got caught with silly shots, and you know, could have made the fight hard. But I just kept him on the end of the jab until I seen openings. Finally, Enzo, what's next for you? I'll fight whoever, you know, me con, uh, my one unification fight, and, uh, you know, let's get on with one of the other champions. Thanks, Enzo. Cheers, Carl.